Hello, welcome to a new episode in the FLTK Rust series. In this episode, we'll be taking a look at the um, FLTK web view. So this allows embedding a web view in your FLTK applications. So I've gone ahead and created this uh, folder and uh, create a new uh, application. So the first thing you need is to import both uh, FLTK and FLTK WebView. Uh, so we'll just copy this. And FLTK, we need version 1.1. And let's just run this. So while it's building, uh, we'll create our typical uh, window for an FLTK application. So So the basic idea is to basically create a window inside a window in FLTK and then the inner window will go, we're going to be used to create the web view itself. So if you check the example here in the crates.io uh, uh, website, it's basically the same as here. And here we create a window called webviewwin and then we just call FLTK WebView, WebView Create. Let's say uh, 790, 590, and we'll place it at the center of the window, center of parent. And here we can basically call uh, the uh, uh, FLTK web view. So and the first argument is uh, whether we need uh, debug for the uh, web view itself. And the second argument is our window. So say false here and here take a mutable reference to our window and then we can call uh, navigate we can also call set HTML let's say google.com Yeah, so spelling mistake. So basically, we get our web view window. Okay. If you wanted to call the set HTML, you can just pass anything as HTML. So let's say um, span So 
So obviously this is not correct HTML, however, uh, you get the idea. Uh, I have an example in the repo uh, using the um, uh, the pull down the pull something just a moment dependencies pull down C mark uh, to parse uh, uh, markdown into HTML and you can check the example in the repo itself uh, if we check here the example so this was uh, this part here yeah style Apparently, not sure if this works with the single uh, parentheses. Okay, so this works. Uh, so some of the limitations of the uh, web view itself is that it, on Windows here, you've uh, you notice that uh, I'm using the MSVC toolchain since uh, the WinRT headers aren't available with the GNU toolchain or not available in the uh, in MinGW or MSYS uh, so that's the main limitation on Windows you basically need the MSVC toolchain on Mac OS you need uh, there are no basic limitations on and on uh, Linux uh, basically runs on Wayland uh, on X11 if you want to run it on Wayland you, you need to pass the GDK backend equals X11 since this actually uses the lib webkit uh, to GTK uh, on GNOME uh, there's some issues uh, with the um, uh, basically reparenting of the uh, web view window inside the FLTK application uh, however it works uh, basically well enough. Uh, contributions are welcome, as always. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.